Hello everyone, David from goldstartool.com. I'm gonna move this maybe myself or this one. How you guys doing? All right, so I'm not gonna be able to open this door and i tell you why. This is a Juki cover stitch, cover stitch 7523. It's a um, under trim computerized sewing machine made by Juki, still made in China. I'm just reading the information. It's an UT under trim and we have a setup on a fully submerged um, table made by us, new tech, and on a T legs. So this is the the top of a line, top of the line cover stitch machine. Direct drive motor. You don't have any motor underneath. Obviously, you have the control panel. You have the motor down there. And what is this thing? There? Shouldn't be dangling. We're gonna close that one later on. But we just will rush to make a video. So this is a um, control panel. Again, computerized, auto cut, auto thread, and auto full lifter. Look at that. Okay, now, uh, a customer that bought this from us wanted us to also put on, and this is what? Something that a lot of people ask us. They want, he, she, or he wanted us to put on the, um, the binder. And this is a binder that we put on for this machine. Um, the cover stitch binder is a clean binder. It's 124P, meaning that when you, there is two types of binding. Number one, you're gonna have this binder and we call it a raw edge, meaning that you fold like this or we have clean finish, meaning fold one, fold twice, and fold together, and you get that clean finish. Okay, so that's a clean finish, beautiful. But before we start, I'm gonna show how this machine works. Again, three needle, five thread, top and bottom stitching. A beautiful, beautiful machine. Imagine, off, turn it on, control panel on, and here we go. Simple. When you put your feet on a pedal, everything goes up. This is right here is the foot lifter. And it's electrical and you don't need air. And yes, it is 120 volt. And yes, you could use it in your home, your garage, whatever. It could work from home. All right? And make, usually, for um, people that use this machine, active wear people, sport wear people, lingerie. Yoga wear, they love this machine. And here we go. Again, this is, I could take this off with a folder and the machine would be flat. And I'm gonna do it at the end. But hold on, let me just start sewing for you, for you guys to see how this machine it is. Just put it in there, put it down. I'm not a sewer, I'm a sewing machine salesperson. Let's see how it's gonna be. You see, this is going very slow. And I could go faster. Done. Cut the thread already. And then you touch this and you take it out. It was supposed to come out very much easier. So you see this one? It didn't cut, it's the top one that is going over. So what you need to do is, that has to be adjusted. This is the one, you see? I'm gonna show you one more time. So first look at what I, what I did. Beauty, top and bottom. If you don't want three needle, you take the middle needle out then you have two needle. If you don't need the top stitch, then you take the yellow out. We color coded the machine, the thread, because we wonder if there is any problem, which, which is the problem. Now, if this is the fun part, and what I'm saying right now could work on any type of sewing machine, any cover stitch, meaning that we could um, cut, bind any type of, can I get some good scissor, senorita? Yeah. Thank you. Caesar, Kihara, a good one, thank you. Put it in there, 
again, this is a cover stitch, but you could do this on new take, on Pegasus, anything. It's a binder, simple binder. You put the binder, you bring it in, and I'm using muslin. It's gonna be much easier when you do this on a uh, regular, okay? Don't get me wrong, it needs some adjustment before you start, but here. So I put in the bias and I pulled it. So right now it seems all right. I'm gonna take some fabric and hopefully it's gonna work. Again, sometimes it doesn't work because I'm not a sewer. But you people at home, you're professional people. You know much better than how to do it. Um, I'm gonna fold this. I'm gonna put it between the lips of the folder, okay? And I'm gonna just, I'm gonna make sure. It's perfect, okay? So the idea is that this sews and goes down and takes this with it, okay? I just want you to see this is going in. Can you come this side, please? I appreciate it. Do I have light? No light. But see the idea is, I don't know how it's going. It might not be, and I'm gonna tell you after I'm finished what we could do to adjust. I'm gonna do one, this finish one. Okay. Look at this. So we just bound, you can't even see it, right? Top, bottom. Now, one of the thread came out. The blue one came out and it's here. And I'm gonna go ahead and put it back in there. If you see something like this happen, Always go to the thread line, see where is it coming from. Why is it, why did it break? Check, make sure it's not very hard. Again, these are the containers that come with the machine that you could put in sewing aids. Drift had a container, small tiny container that called sewing aids that you could pour all in or silicone oil. It's not gonna damage your product. You go in there and the fabric come faster. So I'm gonna try to see what was the problem. We broke this one, bring out the thread, needle clamp, and we just made a video uh, before this for another product, and I, and I said it's pretty normal that on your first try, the thread breaks. You need adjustment, different fabric, different type of thread, different type of needles. They all are hand in hand. It doesn't mean that when people call me as soon as the thread breaks, my machine doesn't work. My machine doesn't work. But it's pretty normal that it, the thread breaks on the first try. And obviously with my beautiful set of eyes, I don't know where to go with this. Come on, David, you could do better than this. I hate it. So again, this, uh, I'm gonna show you the accessory that com come with this, but this is a pretty much made for yoga wear, active wear, and sport wear. Here we go. It should be good. And I'll continue, or I shall continue.
fabric. You gotta cut the fabric here. Imagine you had this raw edge and I just put in the beautiful binding on it. This is the binding on this. Okay? Imagine here, you was regular right here and I put this binding. Now, this is S124B. B stands for double and there is S124A for single. Double means double for clean, A means regular. And this is one and a half inch. We took one and a half inch and gives us three eight each side. Now, again, depend. If you're doing something else, if you're doing a, uh, if you're doing a, a spandex stuff, uh, you might want to check the size. But also, you see here, we have this spring right here. If we have elastic base or spandex stuff, you always want this to go through this from the back. So, if there is any tension, again. Open, put this here, and I'm gonna start sewing. You see how nice it's going here? The way I'm I have to cut this, that's all. Otherwise, it would cut the thread. Here you go. Top, I mean, bottom, top. And this is a beautiful, beautiful sewing. This is really heavy for this machine, but it's doing it. But usually you need to, give me that fabric, please. This is, what you're gonna use is gonna be this type of fabric. These are the one, I'm sorry. Oops. Spandex for bathing suit, for jogging, I don't know, whatever they use. These are the type of fabric that people wanna use. Again, this folder we just added, and if you don't want it, you could just take it down, and I'm gonna, actually, I'm gonna show you. This was done for the customer, but I'm gonna take it out, okay? The top one has to be adjusted to cut the top thread. But this is how the machine is gonna be. And this is the bottom. The oil, you're gonna see the oil from here. This is the, where the thread is gonna go from the bottom. And you have a huge book right here probably. No, they don't do it, they don't give huge books anymore. Everything is online. You could attach this, the label, anywhere you want. This is the map of the thread. The needle is the 128 guys and size 10, really small, again, for really light stuff. What we did, you see, we did very heavy stuff with it. And um, some paper goods, some tools, and more tools. And these are all the book would tell you, these are all, um, fabric guides that I made for the machine. And we also have a lot of different tools for this machine. Hemming, I mean, folding, bottom fold, top fold, everything. Um, again, machine beautiful from uh, Drukey 7523. Now we could see this better. U11-B64 is UT, under trim. Um, made in China, fully submerged with extension for the folder and everything that you want, fully loaded, auto thread cut. And obviously here, there is a um, control panel, CP18, that you could adjust um, for your type of sewing. Again, this is from David from Gold Star Tool. The machine is set on a uh, new tech uh, table, legs with 
Tea legs and wheels, and the machine comes with oil. You put the oil, the food in here, and you'll see it bubbling from here. Uh, a great machine. Another beautiful, beautiful machine from Juki. And we have them in stock. If you don't see any machine in our stock that you're looking for, call us. I have our agents standing by, answering all your questions. If you have a specialty machine, we could get them for you, set them up, deliver, and thank you for watching.